it's your boy T Ray in the reaction. Today is leftover back Friday. Back to diary leftovers, I guess we would call it. So about to do some some videos from stuff I usually do on Thursday, which is NBA videos. So I'm kick things off with some 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 um, voiceover and commentary. So both about the one thing, about one little situation. As LeBron James versus Isaiah Stewart. Who saw that that past week, man? Oh my God, that there was big talk right there. And there's another big talk with LeBron about how he uh, um. Hey, he got like a couple of fans who was heckling him, out rejecting though. Well, folks were trying to call him a, uh, hey, you going to soft? And he a snitch through that. I mean, no. The dude, the dude, the, the, they was like really talking bad shit about his kid. Like, you don't, you don't say shit like about a person's kid. No one wish like, especially let alone wish harm or death on him. Like, like that's, that's just something you don't do. Like, I don't blame him for that. You know what I'm saying. Like all that's all, all everything about the winner right there. He like he look they got light. They they got off easy. I'm gonna put like that for those want to go there. They got off easy because he could have did some. He because he, he's being professional about it and not don't want to be distracted because there's folks who will go on the stands. They let that be around our test. That's the same. Let that be around our test of somebody. Let that be a uh, market smart or Westbrook. Speaking of rest, but you know how it is. So you know I already talked about the LeBron versus Isaiah Stewart fight from the RDC world. So now let's see uh if you want to do first one do a, a voiceover from DJ Michi Meech and a commentary from the one and only Chisel Adonis. And all both videos will be a try not to laugh. So let's get it. Look at your fucking hand off me. Oh, oh. My bad. Oh, hell no. I saw that. It's a technical foul on LeBron James. Oh, shit, they still going. My bad, young blood. It was an accident. You gonna have to fight me? It was an accident, my bad. You gonna have to fight me now? My bad, dude. I said, you gonna have to hey. fight me. I'm gonna beat your ass. Hey, 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 me. hey uh, stop. Hey, 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 hey LeBron. Stop. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm done. Now, fuck that. Stewart, stop. Stop. Chill. Relax. It ain't worth it. Hey, Rondo, don't you start. I'm good. Just wanna see if we got a problem. It was an accident. Come on, fucking hit me on purpose. I just won't talk. I just won't talk. Y'all right. It's my bad. I'm calm. <sighs> now fuck that. Hey, if y'all don't stop him, I'm gonna hit him with another one. Look at him. Look at him. I'm gonna beat him. I'm gonna beat him. I'm gonna hit the little footstep. The little footstep. Scrub, let's go. You gotta fight me first. We can throw them things. That's on crypto. Hey, am I bleeding? No. Hey, am I bleeding? Nah, man. You just sweating. Yo, Russell, what's up? Come on, Stuart. Let it go, man. No. 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 Fuck it. I'm gonna get him on the other side. Stop him. Relaxing. Say yo, I'll see you next time. Let's burn the burner. I may play. Hold on, Lucia, try to read fate to this. Oh man, he playing you know, like a, a, a up uh, his own version of this Billy the Hood song. That was funny. That was hilarious. All right, now we're gonna have one. First off, maybe thought about that. Who saw the video when he did the uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin theme with uh, when Isaiah started running over to them? Who saw that? Let me know. But anyway, next we got the Isaiah. The, now we got the commentary from Chisel Adonis. Let's see what he got to say about this. You know his commentary is hilarious. Again, try not to laugh. Let's get it. What are you waiting for, huh? <laughs> oh! 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 What happened? Do this on me. I'm bad. I'm here to tell you right now. We don't care. Heavens to Betsy, we've got a fracas, a skirmish, a kerfuffle, a brouhaha about to ensue in Detroit. They're no longer the bad boys. This ain't the Palace of Auburn Hills, but Isaiah is not having a good time. He mm -hmm. wants a piece of LeBron James. LeBron James don't want a piece of him. Russell, my man playing the more comment music on the background. Mortal 
Chisel combat. I hate you, Chisel, right now. Westbrook's ready to fight somebody. Legend has it. He's upset he didn't get tickets to the premiere of Space Jam 2. Oh! A member of the Detroit staff has hit the deck. Look at the bottom of the screen. Why is Russell Westbrook so upset? This ain't got nothing to do with him. But, oh, Lord, Isaiah Stewart's been lacerated. Somebody get him a tampon, a pad, or a Band-Aid. His eye has begun its menstruation. He's bleeding profusely. Somebody think of the COVID. Magic Johnson says think of the HIV. It's been 45 seconds. Isaiah Stewart still is as upset as he was at the beginning of the altercation. But it appears that his Wi-Fi dropped. He's disoriented, not too sure why he's upset. Sister. Rebooting in five. I'm mad. Nani? Oh Lord, he's free. You would have thought he was playing mad in the way he truck sticking no, people. He did. I haven't seen this much friendly fire since the Civil War. But why was Russell Westbrook trying to square up? I thought the conflict was with LeBron James. Isaiah Stewart want to fight everybody on the Lakers. Rumor has it he unfollowed Kobe Bryant when he made it to the locker room. This man Westbrook would rather hit people than hit jump shots. Stewart had about 15 seconds face to face with LeBron James. He did a whole lot of nothing. His hands were free and never swung once. This ain't nothing more than a shoving match and an exchange of carbon dioxide between a bunch of men. He had more than enough time to hit LeBron yeah, square in the face. But all he did was stare Bron in his eyes and whisper his transgressions about Bronny having more followers than him on Instagram. At this Whoa. moment, I thought perhaps he was going to throw a punch, but everybody already had him surrounded. But keep an eye on Westbrook in the back. Man start a follow-up in an altercation would be recorded as a assist on the stat sheet. He going to get a triple-double one way or another. Despite the fact they had Stewart restrained, look at Westbrook find his way to Stewart's face again. I'm not sure Dude, what Westbrook's plan here Westbrook is, but ready. Stewart not paying him no mind. Just look Westbrook's at LeBron, ready. perplexed, flummoxed, flabbergasted, not too sure what led to this man being so goddamn upset. Isaiah's still mad. This man is on demon time. What the hell they holding Rondo back for? Where's Dexter Morgan when you need him? Get the M99. It's been nearly three minutes. This man is still trying to get loose. He in the wrong sport. He out here trying to catch rebounds Lord. when he should be in the UFC hitting people with clubbing blows. And somebody tell me how it took nearly three minutes for somebody to finally get a towel to try to wipe the blood right. off this man's face. And they failed at doing that as well. Detroit's entire staff need to be fined. This man was upset for an entire length of a commercial break. And for whatever reason, when they finally got him into the tunnel to head to the locker room, he broke free and he's going to try to exit on the other side. Get security around the Lakers bus. He might slash their tires. Stop. Woo. Oh, man. That was funny. That was hilarious. That was hilarious. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Both Bishi and Chisel are fools. I love it. You gotta love them, though. Shout out to them both, though. Other than that, if you like my reaction, like, share, subscribe to the channel. It's your boy T-Burst. I know. One love.